So today we're gonna be doing probably my m most cursed Amora build ever. Maybe even my most most cursed build ever, just in general. Because we're gonna be using the Zaitsev's Eruptions projectiles for damage. <laughs> and it's a build pretty much only like usable on PC, cause you need to do some shenanigans for the Zaitsev's Eruptions projectiles to do damage. So let's do it. For the gear, we have a free radical with Urad for our second wins. Even though we have sustainment, then you know, Urad's not gonna help us because we're gonna be healed. I got an angel because you can, if you wanna guardian angel swap the Zeiss of Surruptions projectiles for Giga damage and be really evil <coughs> with 150 90. Create an MP5 for movement speed. And then a Zeiss of Surruption in every element except for radiation. Maybe I should actually fix the Zeiss of Surruption to be times two and a half plus heat per shot so that I can break it faster. So we're doing a Zeiss Eruption in every element times two. Cause if it's times two then it breaks faster so you can, you know, have it ready for sending projectiles faster. And we want the consecutive hits anoint for for our anoint. We're not doing radiation cause you know why. And then a triple vagabond revolter with action skill stun anoint. Triple vagabond I really like because it gives movement speed. I prefer it over absorb in emo. Phase Zerker with plus five conflux and for the passives you want splash damage radius, splash damage and, and assault rifle damage. Snowdrift Victory Rush with corrosive damage movement in an area of effect damage. The Zeta Eruptions projectiles are oh, I have the wrong scope. The Zeta Eruptions projectiles are splash, so having splash damage bonuses is gonna be really nice. Except you need to be careful with its self damage because it can down you easily. And a level 1 Mesmer with AC radiation to have explosions going on. And then for like movement speed, like if you don't get there even faster, then you can rest on to victory rush with movement speed, double movement speed, and area of effect damage. And a shooter, any passive doesn't matter. We're pretty much not gonna be using it. And this is the. Triple Roid Madcap I got on the Arms Race video in the Arms Race video yesterday. And then this is an internal flame I found from Wo 10 during my testing. Pretty funny. So for the skill tree, this is pretty much gonna be just, you know, Hellzarker. Except I need to look at it again because I don't exactly mem remember. Yes, <coughs> this is pretty much Hellzarker. Except we're not doing 3 points into Transcend. Those three points are going into Unweave the Rainbow, even though we're not doing Cryo, but they're just like doing Cryo. I'm gonna pretty much just send the Hellzerker skill tree in the description so that I won't need to show show it all. Because Hellzerker is in the build dock. And I've made and I've made many a build video with which are pretty similar, which have pretty similar skill trees to Halzerker. See, the Zeiss Disruption sends out projectiles or is ready faster with times 2 because you need to shoot it less times. But so, this is pretty much gonna be a build for PC users or like keyboard and mouse users because if you want the extra. Zeiss Disruption projectile spam, you need to spam your emote arrows, e emote keys, so the arrow keys. Because I'm gonna show you uh, what happens. Yeah, we just kinda send out many projectiles in a second. And so for turret guys, well, I can actually do the Zeiss Disruption normally for these guys. <laughs> Sometimes even the projectors, the projectors can go into the floor. And if, if I'm in 5 feet life, then I can't send out... Then I can't mass send out projectiles, because, you know, I can't emote spam, because I can't emote. No, walls. And if, if you want, you can also debuff enemies with the Zeiss disruption, and if you want to switch to a different gun, you can also do that. I wonder if the Zeiss disruption's debuff applies to itself. Like, if if you hit enemies with its projectiles, with its debuffing projectiles, then 
Do they also have increased damage? Oh no, oh okay. Yeah, this is kinda a, a hard situation. <laughs> boom, boom, I'm still recording. Boom, 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 pop barrels. And Titan Bind works for the projectiles. I don't know what exactly the, they. Well, what is their damage type? <laughs> oh my god. Sometimes going down with it can be annoying. I never really. I've never really got annoyed from it, <laughs> though. Okay, the doors. When there are no enemies, it's gonna be a hard time. Or wh wh when, when the, there are enemies behind walls. Carefully mesmer those guys. And then can I do this? No, because it's going into the floor. Wait. <laughs> Fuck. Okay, now die, die. Cool. It's actually a yeah, pretty viable build. Can I send a projectile from this far? No. I need to go in a safe spot for this. You can you're gonna basically hear just me spamming the arrow keys all the time. Okay, I hope I won't somehow go go right in the floor, of course. Uh, protect us, hello? Why won't you wanna work? Projectiles. Oh! And there are also gonna be a lot of frame drops. <laughs> maybe, maybe I just need to jump. Or not, cause... Maybe I can send out projectiles to mismerge enemies. Maybe that's what's up. Look at the health bar. Oh, wow. I just ate her. No. <laughs> Why? Not for the worst one? Oh, that looks weird. It, it's like basically the, okay, the gargoyle ball spam. Flag build video I made. Was it Flag or Amar? I can't remember. <laughs> Are there any Isa Saugas? Let's let's take care of Ruta first. Oh, I took care of Hilda as well. Or I can also do this, except it's slower. <laughs> and also the Garden Angel swap. I'm a savage. Frozen snowshoe recharge burner. Acid burn in the vending machine. Let's see if I'll die instantly. Oh, okay, no. We. I really want to do a fire Zites of Seraphim. And it's for God, if you say, one more time, if you say that it's pronounced ZTF's eruption, then I'm gonna personally go to your house and drink water with you. Fuck. It's guys, it's pronounced ZTF's eruption. Not ZTF's. I'm gonna just go to to the end of the bridge. Game, not one takedown. Truly the best content ever. Projectiles. Giga damage. Shit. 
Okay, no, 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 no. Oh! Oh, no, no, no. See, even for shooting, the, that instruction for shooting is also kind of pretty good. I feel like I went down like 10 times. Let's take care of death skulls. Okay, fire heavy, let's see. Most of the projectiles are going for the other guys and not the fire heavy. <laughs> like, they're even going upwards. Okay, he's immune. Never mind. Spam! Oh! Holy frame drop. I'm waiting for you, bro. Nope. Let's see if it's gonna send up for the house. It does! Okay, done. Let's switch back to the Curlusive one. Two of the same, the same shields, except the part placement is different. Let me, let me take a screenshot of that. Cool. Ah! Oh wow. Uh! I won't puke, guys. Don't worry. I won't puke. You. Sh Cutting for 12 minutes. No, look, look, look at this health bar. Okay, that was kind of slow. Let's do some garden, garden angeling. You can kind of reach Wotan from here. Oh, speed demon. <laughs> Yeah, we're running Mayhem 10 with Speed Demon, Pain Tolerance, Drone Ranger, and Post Mortem. <laughs> At the end of the fucking video, I mentioned Mayhem Modifiers. Reload. Let's do no gun in swapping, how about that? Mesmer. Don't go for Wotan. Oh, wait. Hold on, wait, I could get an insta kill. On the bottom half, sure. Now the predictors are gonna just track the. Okay, never mind. The top half for like, an, for like a century. Uh, binary operator takes boom. Flacker, Stormfront, Moonfire. And Moonfire. It's a fire, fire, fire. See you tomorrow with a video about something. Maybe maybe a, maybe a pre sequel video or something like that. Maybe just showing different weapons with the Jacob's Sniper loop glitch? Maybe? See you tomorrow. Bye bye.